We all experience or have experienced different digestive problems such as an upset stomach, gas and bloating, heartburn, acidity, diarrhea and constipation many times in our life. These problems cause a lot of discomfort and many disruptions in our life and some of us experience these problems more than others and would really really like to get rid of them. So, no worries whether you experience these problems in low frequency or in high frequency. Just watch this video till the end to get rid of your digestive problems naturally and to improve and strengthen your digestive system and be at greater ease and comfort. And so, let's get started. Hello everyone. Welcome again to Lifestyle Speaks channel. My name is Dr. Surangna and I make videos related to healthy living, nutritious foods, and we are bring inner peace for a healthier lifestyle. If you are still not subscribed to my channel, hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon in the end to get latest updates from Lifestyle Speaks. Before we understand about digestive problems and their natural treatment, it is very important that we all understand in brief about a body's digestive process. So when we eat food, our mouth chews it and the chewed food along with the saliva that is released from the mouth is referred to as bolus which gets swallowed through the esophagus from where it moves to a stomach. In the stomach, the food is mixed with different digestive juices to form a liquid called chyme. This liquid moves to the small intestine. In the small intestine, the food is mixed with digestive juices secreted by liver, pancreas and intestine. The digestive nutrients are absorbed in our bloodstream and the waste products move through the large intestine which converts it into a stool that is released out from our body. The different digestion problems that we all experience can be treated naturally by adopting certain lifestyle habits. This is because most of the digestion problems we experience are either due to lifestyle problems or stress or the foods that we eat or the wrong way of eating foods. There are also many medications that are available which provide short-term relief from these digestion problems but the usage should be minimized as much as we can and we should try to adopt natural ways to solve and get rid of our digestive problems. The first step in the digestive process is chewing of foods in our mouth. And it is very important that we chew our foods properly before swallowing them to enhance our digestive process. This is because the better we chew our foods properly, the better it will be broken down to smaller particles which will be easy to move through our esophagus. Also, the more properly we chew our foods, more saliva will be released in the mouth which will begin the digestion of foods before they can reach the stomach. And it will also give our stomach the time to get ready by preparing all the digestive juices needed for digestion. This step is generally overlooked by many of us, but it cannot be taken lightly. And for that, it is very important that we always take small bites over large bites. We eat our food slowly and we chew our food till the time it dissolves. And in this way, not only our body's digestive system will be enhanced, but also we will be able to enjoy the taste of our food better. And our body will also be able to absorb more nutrients from the food that we eat. Stress or anxiety in any form can disrupt the proper functioning of a body's digestive system. Many of us may have noticed that we experience an upset stomach or indigestion before any big exam, interview or event. And this is because of stress that impacts the connection between our brain and gut. Do you know that our brain plays a very important role in activating many different digestive juices and enzymes? So it is very important that it is relaxed for our body's efficient digestion. So if you're in stress, it is very important that first you relax and you take a few deep breaths before you eat your meal so that your brain is calm and you can have a proper digestion. Also, it is very important that you try to reduce stress in your life by making lifestyle changes and adopting yoga, meditation and listening to soft music to calm yourself. The next very important thing is that you should never rush your meals because this will also cause your body to be in stress and it can impact your body's digestive functioning. So always take out proper time for your meals and ensure that you're never in a hurry to eat them. If you're doing a work or you're involved in some other activities such as watching TV or reading books and newspapers and you're eating our food, then we do not properly notice what is actually going inside our stomach. 
and this can strongly harm us by causing gas, bloating and indigestion. This is because our brain will then be diverted to some other task rather than being involved in the process of digestion. So it is very important that we start by appreciating the foods that we eat. We focus and pay attention to the smell, taste and textures of the different foods that we eat. We get rid of all our work, our gadgets and television when we are eating our food. It is very important to understand that if we do not appreciate our food, our body will also not appreciate it leading to poor digestion. So it is very important that we start focusing only on the foods we eat and we do not focus on any other thing when we are eating our meal. One more thing is that these days we are also involved in eating healthy foods. But if we do not pay attention to the food that we are eating, then our body will not be able to properly digest that healthy food and will not be able to absorb nutrients from it. And in the end, we will still remain unhealthy. So there will be just no point in investing so much of money and eating healthy foods when our body is not able to properly digest it or absorb nutrients from it. According to Ayurveda, we should eat foods with our hands because it can help to provide efficient digestion, it can help to get rid of our digestive problems and it can help us to get maximum health benefits from the foods that we eat. This practice or Indian tradition of eating foods with our hands has long been forgotten and there are very few people who eat food with their hands nowadays and many of us tend to eat food with forks and spoons. However, eating food with the hands is very beneficial as it is believed that when the nerve endings of our fingertips comes in contact with the food that we eat, it provides a signal to our brain to start secreting digestive juices in our gut which allows for efficient digestion. Also, there is some type of flora which is present in our fingers too and when it uh, enters our body along with the foods that we eat, it helps to promote healthy digestion in our gut. Also, the practice of eating foods with our hands helps us to relish our foods more and allows us to better engage with its texture and taste. But it is very important that we wash our hands properly with soap and water before we eat our foods with our hands. Regular eating habits can also affect our gut and digestive process badly. So it is very important that we maintain and follow a proper schedule for eating all our meals. To know when is the right time for eating our meals, you can check out my previous video whose link can be found in the description box below. Also, it is very important that instead of having two to three heavy meals, we eat smaller meals at regular intervals and we learn to control our portion size. This is because then our body will be efficiently able to digest the foods that we eat. Lastly, we should avoid all late night eatings as during that time our body's metabolism is very slow. So whatever foods we eat during that time will lead to very strong indigestion and many digestive problems. For the foods to move from the stomach to the small intestine, it is very important that the food is converted to a liquid form. And for that, two things is very important. First is proper chewing of the foods which I have discussed previously. And second is stomach acids. If our stomach has low levels of stomach acids, then it will take longer time to break down the foods due to which the foods will remain in the stomach for a longer time period. And there they will start to ferment which will lead to gas and bloating and over time will lead to heartburn and acidity as some of the acids will leak from the stomach into the esophagus. So it is very important that we maintain efficient levels of stomach acids in our stomach to ensure proper digestion. And the best way to boost your stomach acids naturally for efficient digestion and absorption of nutrients is by drinking lemon water. And this is very easy. You can just squeeze lemon in your water and you can drink this lemon water between your meals to ensure efficient digestion and to get rid of your digestive problems. It is very important that we pay attention and listen to our body and its signals and we understand that when we are hungry and when we are full. And it is very important that we only eat when we are hungry otherwise we may overeat which can lead to gas, bloating, indigestion and acidity. Also, many of us tend to overeat when we are emotional or when we are anxious. So it is very important that we try to give up on this habit so that we can improve our digestive problems. Another very important thing is that we should listen to a body's signal of relaxing and breathing for a few minutes after we eat any meal before rushing out for any work or any other thing. It is important that we give a little bit time to a body to relax after we have taken a meal so that a body can digest the food properly. 
both fibers and probiotics which are the live microorganisms are very important for efficient digestion and for solving all our digestive problems fibers are present in legumes whole grains fruits and vegetables nuts and seeds and they help in regulating bowel movement and also preventing diarrhea on the other hand probiotics are found in yogurts that help to support and stimulate our gut health which can say goodbye to all our digestive problems and to know more in detail about gut health why it is important probiotics and high fiber foods you can check out my previous video whose link can be found in the description box below we all have experienced digestive problems in our life and some of them may be severe and difficult to prevent but others can be rid of by making simple adjustments in what we eat when we eat and how we eat like i have discussed in my today's video so that's it for today i hope you found today's video useful and if you did give this video a like and comment below to share your thoughts don't forget to share this video more and more with your friends and family members love your life and make it charismatic see you next time stay safe stay healthy keep smiling and keep watching lifestyle speaks